What's going on guys, Mishigashu, we are back with another Uma Musume video. This time we have our new banner here and it's for Admire Vega, but if you guys didn't notice, I'm pretty sure you guys did by now, that we do have the first anniversary coming up next week, if I'm not mistaken, around next Thursday or probably Friday, one of those days. Uh, that's why the lobby looks like this. And also, um, on Valentine's Day, if you guys didn't do this, it was basically just a gift from a horse girl of your choice. And this one I chose Teo, and it looks like it just gives TP from what it looks like. And then also for this video, we are also going to go over the first anniversary missions. Uh, but first we'll go over Admire Vega real quick over here. We won't be doing any pulls just because... Next week is the first year anniversary. Actually, we could do one pull here because I'm I forgot I I totally said I was gonna do the main all the majority of the pulls or if not all the pulls on the other account. So we'll do a pull here since I do have enough for one. Just to see if we can get Admire Vega or possibly someone else. Uh, but let's go over stats for for now. So at level one, she has 96 speed. 79 stamina, 108 power, 69 guts, and 98 uh, wise. Oh, before I also move on, um, there's also, I saw a notice in the news, but also was mentioned through a comment from Uma Simp, she, uh, just to mention that there's a, a guts update, and I looked over it, and it said, like, the more guts we have, uh, the last spurt will be better from... That's from what I got out of it. There are a lot more updates that they're planning to do, but I'm not sure if it already took place. Because it said the balance adjustment notice was going to take place on the 24th, which I assume is they're going to get it ready by the time it'll hit first year anniversary. So basically, um, they adjust it so that the higher the guts, the faster the speed at the last spurt. And then there's like a few, not a, a few other things they did. Uh, they also adjusted to make easier to overtake during the effect time skills that improve course taking so just a lot of updates this is a long list so if you guys want to check out um that list in their game news page it's just a lot to put down like i'm looking at the list right now there's a lot mentioning a lot of uh, horse girls probably nearly all the units maybe or maybe just the older units i'm not too sure there's a lot of those and then um they adjusted some of the skills, or a lot of the skills, but the one that was mentioned to me was the whole Guts uh, update. So with that being said, I'm planning to do a Guts run this week, and then we'll do another one next week, uh, just to see if there's a difference. I did run a... I did do one run off camera before uh, recording this video, and uh, let me show you guys that result real quick. So. I have it right here. I think it was right here. So I managed to use um, get an A plus using Teo right over here. As you guys can see, I got an A on guts, B plus on power, B and stamina, 1200 speed, and a C and wise, which is honestly I did have a good RNG going on, so I'm not sure if that played a huge factor, but um. We did only lose one race. It was the fault. No, it was the Osaka High, I think. I think. <laughs> it, was, it was either that or the fault and no show. But yeah, I mean, I did run the Guts cards. I did um, three Guts cards. Three Guts cards, two speed and one uh, friend card, which is Riko Kashimoto. And uh, I'm pretty much going to do the same thing. I'm going to show you guys uh, how it's going to be for that run in the next Pretty Derby video. I was going to do another measure of Arden, but I'll probably push that one uh, after the next video. So moving on with Admire Vega. We, she is a turf runner. She is... It looks like she can do miles and long distance. While she's for sure can do medium distance. As long as you bring up the inheritance, of course, then you can for sure do these two. And then she is a chaser, but you could also use her as a betweener. And then gonna look at her level five stats over here. 
118 speed, 96 stamina, 132 power, 85 guts, and 119 wise. And then looking at her skills, this is her... Excuse me. This is her unique skill, Meteor of Dis Use Curry. If you're far away from the front on the last straight, your speed will increase. That makes sense from her positioning. <laughs> based on her racing position. And then this one is slight detour when blocked during last spurt, becomes slightly better at navigating through it. Uh, binding chains, beat for medium distance, slightly slows down girls in the front if you're behind in the final leg. This one is serene for chasers. When front is crowded, slightly calm down and remain composed. As for awakening skills, if you go level two, it is this one. For chasers, get ready to pass during the final leg and become slightly better at positioning. Then we have the gold version of Serene, calm and collected. When, when front is crowded, calm down and remain composed. Leaders restrain, restrain and slightly tire out girls with the strategy leader and the opening leg. And then storm and stress, get ready to pass during the final leg and become better at positioning. Now with that being said, let's actually use this pink ticket first. Just get it out of the way for our single summon. And hopefully we get lucky. You never, you never know. I know I've done it before. Uh, long shot star, and that's pretty sure it's nothing. And then we'll do our one pull over here before I go over the missions. So, will we get something? I don't know. Oh, yo, yo, the red door. <laughs> we are getting someone. Favorite star. Now, how many are we gonna get? We're gonna get oh there it is maybe we'll get a fake out and one of the gold or silver gates but we'll see wonder what who we're gonna get <laughs> what if we end up getting retro art and w oh i didn't get a good who's that oh it's the new year's haru uro well, looks like we got someone else to use now, too. And it's going to be interesting to use because um, Haruura is her, her schedule isn't really the best for her, in my opinion. But I have managed to get an A plus with the original Haruura, so it will be fine. It will be just fine. Actually, let's see what else has came out. Did we get anything for the support cards? No, we did not. These are just repeat if you guys do want a good wise card though if you do use wise cards fine motion is one of the best ones you can get so if you guys want to you can go for it but i still say don't do it since uh the one year anniversary is coming up and i think in my other account i do have about 14k carrot jewels so we should be good for um the banner that's coming up in the the one year anniversary I blanked out for like a sec so now let's go take a look at the mission would be right here I'm just gonna just go to the page so I'm doing the first anniversary missions over here so I'm just gonna read it out in order um, so basically this one's clear all events I have completed some so I'm just gonna read out the list that I see over here um, so complete a training run having raised a total of three support card bonds to max one. So basically support cards, you want to just max them out to, uh, max bond. So at least three of them. Complete the training run having at least 10 skills max because there's seven and then there's 10. So I'm just going to say the, the bigger number. So 10 skills at least so you can get about, I think that's 30k, 30k gold then complete a training run having won at least 15 races clear a training objective 40 times complete a training run 10 times complete a training run with a rank c plus or higher once complete an ura finals training run once complete an aharu high training run once i'll probably have to do ura finals one don't i yeah i have to so i would have to just do that off camera and then participate in a team sta uh, stadium match 10 times that's pretty much it. Pretty simple. First anniversary missions. 
they do end on March 29th. So you guys have over a year, I mean, over a year, over a month to uh, finish these missions. Uh, if you guys are still curious about these G1 missions, I know I didn't mention any of these. Uh, but basically, complete training 10 times, win the Tokai stakes once during training, win the Negishi stakes once during training, and win the February stakes once during training. Uh, I think all I pretty much need to do is all of them, <laughs> from what it seems like. Um, I don't know what the Tokai, Negishi, and the February stakes are, so I'm gonna have to look that up. Uh, so it looks like Tokai Stakes is a G2 race that takes place on the third year in late January, so G2 dirt race, uh, 1800 miles, I mean 1800 meters. Um, the Negishi Stakes is the uh, same month, third year, late January, and it's also a dirt race, short 1400 meters. And then the February Stakes is, oh I know these races, the, it's a dirt race. 1600 meters third year late february and it's also and this one's a g1 race other than that that's pretty much all it is so i'll probably be able to do this with like harura maybe or i'll just do anyone so anyone else who can do dirt races basically and i haven't done this yet i know which race i have to do but i still haven't done it and i think that's pretty much it guys oh and if you guys haven't done the legends race for gold city um i haven't finished it i think today's the last day before it updates during noon but by the time uh you guys see this video pretty much <laughs> pretty much done by then and yeah with that being said guys that's pretty much gonna sum up the video there's nothing much for me to talk about but uh, in the next Uma Musume video or Pretty Derby video, we will do a Guts run. I'll most likely end up using Teo again. Either that or I'll probably use Biwa or anyone that has a growth rate in Guts, pretty much. Or if you guys want to see who I can do the Guts run, um, guts run with, uh, let me know down in the comments and I'll, I'll make it happen. But... I think before that, I'm going to probably do Teo or maybe even Narita Taishin because I think she has it in Guts. Yeah, Guts and Speed. So we'll see what I decide to do. If you guys do want to see someone specific, though, let me know down in the comments when it comes to this Guts run. And then, yeah, with that being said, guys, if you guys made it this far in the video, I want to say thank you. And if you guys can, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Also, leave a comment down below, like I said, on who you want to see me run with the guts uh cards or the guts build or just anyone specific uh i still need to do another measure arden video and then we can also do a haruura video she does run guts so or have a guts growth rate so that'll probably be a good option to even try doing that but um yeah with that being said guys i'll see you in the next one peace